Okay, I got this at 35 millimeters. And it's F5.6, one one thousandth of a shutter speed. And now I'm on my way to work. Yeah, you gotta be careful with people driving. So, at the beginning of school, there was a whole bunch of cars. All right football practice and stuff and uh, I think it was a tryout that's why it was so busy well tryouts are over with and everything's manageable either that or they're already in class so I don't have to wait there for 15 minutes. Yep, knew it, got the light. So I ordered a Billo um, hand grip for the R8. It'll uh, hold two batteries. Plus, it'll be bigger in my hand. So I'll do a um, examination of it. Put it up. Hold it. Carry it around. They got one where it's just an extra extender. Uh, just takes one battery but at least it'll fit in your hands you know an extra grip so it doesn't matter to me if my pinkies underneath the camera or whatever I it doesn't affect me okay uh, in fact I would rather have it that way but uh, I'm looking at battery extension I do have bags where with the dummy battery, I can go for like eight hours, ten hours, whatever. Um, you can put it on power save where it turns off after 30 seconds, all that stuff, just to save battery, okay? Um, same thing with the LCD screen since it has an EVF. But like I was saying, I'm thinking of getting rid of Z5. I'm thinking about the Z30 also. 
but uh, I have the A6100, which I can put up there uh, for a table, but I might put the R8 up there. I don't know. So I want, on my Studio 64, good glass. And I have an A7C, which is full frame, the old Sony, 6100, and then the, um, this camera right here, ZB-1 Mark II. I was thinking of getting another ZB-10, but uh, anyhow, I uh, decided against it because my heart set up on the new ZF, not the Z8 or the Z9. I like to get the ZF. Take a look at it. But it depends if there's a 30 minute uh, record time limit. So, anyhow. Announcement's supposed to be tomorrow, and then they'll give a later date, but hopefully I'll be retired then to pick it up. be going the highway unfortunately yeah I leave early and people are on a phone call probably the uh, manager or was on the uh, call for the postmaster general well not here in San Antonio that is postmaster San Antonio they have a weekly call with all the letter carriers and stuff. Uh, you know, the substations. And um, that's going on. sparse today. Usually it picks up, but I haven't gone to 1604 yet. pick up a couple more batteries you know for the R8 the only reason why I bought the R8 is uh, I was waiting for the ZF and I got 
a little perturbed, waiting, waiting, waiting. And if nothing pans out uh, tomorrow or today, any no news on it, well, guess what? Say la vie. construction area. They started working on the left hand side but they haven't done anything so they're working on these uh, columns right here on the right trying to finish them up. see cars jockeying here and there. There's a Tesla in black. Yeah, uh, too bad they don't have uh, solar panels. So this lane will end right here. Here's the grooves I always complain about, the old hash marks for the lane. They're coming along with those metal rails. I don't know if they're metal or cement, okay? Uh, usually, uh, they were putting down for metal and then they would rust and uh, it gave a, a different type of look, you know, at the other interchanges. So, this one's all white underneath. see one or two guys working okay and the rest are standing around talking and I see stuff called back what's going on here I think they closed off Street. May have to take Wiener. Yeah, they got no car. Yeah, a lot of people getting off. I'm going to go straight. I'm going to brave it. Believe it or not, going to Thousand Oaks uh, is a little bit quicker. Yes, they get about three or four stoplights uh, if you take Wurzbach, or I mean O'Connor. So you see, they're going to build towers here all the way to 410. Look at all the rebar that they pulled out of it. Oh my goodness.
And this is why the traffic is slowing down. So I see they put one side up. Yeah, I'm going to Wiener. Accident, right lane closed. Loop 410. That truck was delaying everybody, and this van is delaying everybody, too. I always want to get ahead. Some drive slow, some drive fast. There we go. You got it. Some people can't make up their mind. So this is Lookout Road on the other side of the stoplight, but I'll be making the left up here to get on Morris Park Parkway. I usually get off of here to make a left or go straight beyond that uh, stoplight to go home. And this light does not last long, so I'm going to try to make it. And the problem is, this is kind of like a caddy corner. And the other problem, they uh, moved to one lane. And you'll see that coming up. So usually I get off at Thousand Oaks. So you see, you see Wonderland, Morgan's Wonderland right here with soccer fields, you know, for the kids and stuff. I hear the motorcycle. Here's the silo old uh, cement factory. I'm surprised they haven't knocked it down for security reasons. Well, for safety reasons, actually. So, this is a different way of coming. Usually I go down Nacogdoches from right to left. So at this stoplight, I say uh, thank you for watching. 
Uh, if you like this type of content, please give me a like, subscribe. Any comments or questions, put it down below. And remember, stay safe, keep smiling. Until next time, I shall see you then. Goodbye.